For this problem, we're going to use implicit differentiation to find a second derivative of an equation. So here's our equation, 17x squared plus y squared equals 9. The first thing we're going to do is find the first derivative. Then we're going to take a second derivative. And our final step will be when we have a first derivative after step 2, we're going to take what we found in step 1 and plug that in. So let's start off by taking the first derivative. When we take the first derivative, the right-hand side, the derivative with respect to x of 9 is just 0. And we're going to need to use the chain rule for the left-hand side, because we need to remember that y is actually a function of x. And we do this, and we go ahead and solve for dy dx. And we find that dy dx is equal to negative 17 times x over y. I usually rewrite 1 over y as y to the negative 1, because I have an easier time doing derivatives that way. So now what I'm going to do is my second derivative, and on the right-hand side I'm going to have to use the product rule. So I'll do that, and then again I'll have to use the chain rule when I deal with taking the derivative with respect to x of y. Once I do that, I'm left over with another dy dx. So that's when I'm going to do step 3, and that is to take the answer that I got from step 1, that is that dy dx equals negative 17x times y to the negative 1 power, and I'm going to plug that in. Now, what I'm going to say is the solution in the My Math Lab, when you get this question wrong, they've done some more simplification, but you don't have to do that. The answer I've given does get marked correct in the homework, so there's really no need to go any further with this.